Hello and welcome to Lancaster tonight with me, your host, Siri Hansbaugh. And it's the last episode for the term, so we have to make sure we end um, this term's series with high energy. So that's why we've got our amazing crew and even a studio audience again. Woo! Woo! Yeah! Woo! Yes! Woo! <laughs> that's what we need. Um, yeah, we've got some very special guests as well this week. We've got Sam Possible, Rueda Kandka and Chris Osborne, who are all good friends of mine, but also very interesting people. So we'll ha be having a chat to them a little bit later on. Um, a very festive show that we've got planned. It's going to be a cracker. Woo! Get it? <laughs> it's a great fun. We've got more puns to come as well with the rest of the show. But for now, let's have a look at what is the Christmas gossip in Sladeburn House this week. Friday in Sladeburn House, and Craig and Syria editing footage they took from the Christmas market. Got a good script going. Got a good script. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the edit's going fine. Yeah, I mean, it'll fine. be fine. You know what? You know what I've noticed though. What? I've just kind of noticed that Pete, he's a bit of a Grinch. Like I feel like he hates Christmas. Like, yeah, I've never seen him be festive yeah, at all. Yeah, exactly. I mean, he wouldn't even come to the Christmas markets with no. us. Like, he just refused to go there. And, you know, I've never seen him wear a Christmas jumper. Like, it's December. No, Christmas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, here you are. I'm, I'm in a Christmas got yours. Sh shirt. I've got my elf. Like, but I've, I've, I've never, just never seen Pete be Christmassy. And, you know what? It Honestly, it breaks my heart a bit. I, I just wish he was just... A little bit more festive. A little festive. bit Christmassy. So that was Party Pete making his big debut. But now let's welcome Sam Possible. Yes, Woo! Sam. Woo! Hello. Welcome, welcome, Sam. Hi, sir. How are you doing? I'm good, yeah, yeah. Last week of term, a bit stressed, yeah. but um, I was excited for Christmas. So, yeah. yeah, you said you've got a 2,000 word uh, I essay. May, I may do that, <laughs> yeah. Um, but you know, nah, I've this got is my priorities priority. sorted, yeah, exactly, that's why I'm here. So, yeah. Exactly, yeah. So, Sam, let's just, you know, throw back, like, take our minds back to when we first met. You know, first became friends. When was I that? don't remember. Yeah. Like I keep, I invite people on my show, and I'm like, how did we even become friends? Because it just kind of comes out of nowhere. Oh, I, re I remember actually. I remember the first time I saw you was um, at the Student Media Awards yes, uh, that's in the first Bar. Yes, I saw you in, as well. In um, what was it? It's 2015. 2015. Yeah, no, 2016. 2016. Yeah. So um, first year of uni, and. Um, I, I got best newcomer. You um, did, and you were up against me. I was I was in that. Uh. <laughs> Here we go. And so I made a speech just <laughs> insulting Siri and just kind of like rubbing it in. But no, yeah. but basically, yeah. <laughs> uh, no, I, I made a speech just kind of like a really cringy, cheesy <laughs> speech, and you were there just like 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 kind of like. <laughs> yeah, I was just like I was heartbroken. Yeah, but it was fine. I I thought I lost to a good person. Okay, right. Yeah. Thank you. I okay. did think that because I mean I'd heard about you but I didn't actually know you. So that was the first time I saw you, but I thought, he does a lot of bail rig stuff. Yes, so yeah, yeah, and yeah. that's probably how most people know me, yeah. actually. Yeah, bail rig. But, um, yeah, and then uh, later on, you asked me to come on to Good Morning Lancaster. Yes. Where, where I basically just insulted Patrick uh, <laughs> on air, which is very that's fun. That's true. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, since then, yeah, I've been And then our fun. friendship has just blossomed yeah. from there. You came onto my radio show. I did, yeah. yeah um, we'll, we'll talk a little bit about that a okay, bit later yeah, on. Okay, we'll sure. Jump in the gun a bit now. Yeah, no, I, I just like to plug as much <laughs> stuff as possible, basically. I mean, you've got your chance to plug as much as you want right at the end. Okay, brilliant. Yeah. Okay. But for now, just what what do you um, get up to on Bail Rig then? Like, um, um, so yeah, how did you start doing all that? Other than my radio show, yeah. um, I basically joined Bail Rig um, around the second term. Um, so this t around this time in, actually, maybe I think around this time in first mm -hmm. year, I was really getting into Bail Rig. Um, but I really got into it in second term when the elections and the exec and decided I, kind of, I could kind of like do the uh, the marketing for Bailwick. Mm -hmm. um, so, you know, if you see any posters or anything from Bailwick or social media, really, um, that's kind of like what my job is, with, mm -hmm. uh, basically. Um, and you do a good job. Thank you. You do yeah. a very good job. Yeah. Um, I like to try and bring as many other people mm -hmm. on board as possible with it to make yeah. my life a bit easier. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, no, like it's, it's, uh, it's been really fun. 
Um, and yeah, I hope to carry on doing mm -hmm. it for another term. Yeah. So yeah, and we can also give a shout out to you because you designed our logo. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I you mean, you designed the LA One TV logo. It was, it was, a, it was, a, it was a long, you know, like you know, discussion <laughs> kind of process. Yeah. But you know, yeah, there I'm were many a Skype call to like <laughs> tweak like the odd little thing. <laughs> well, see, the thing is, it's like it's, I don't know. I'm really happy with it. Um, because really every, everybody it. here is really happy with mm -hmm. it so yeah um it, it means a lot but yeah that was a really extra response because mm -hmm. i was hanging around the station a lot for it yeah exactly and yeah speaking to you guys a lot and uh yeah it was really nice to see you guys happy with the new fresh logo yeah so. we d we definitely needed a fresh new logo and we'd seen what you'd done with like the bail rig you know new designs and we thought we need sam <laughs> we mean, need sam and you were like so like such a pleasure to work with oh, as well you. like we need you again. Yeah, it's nice. Do, do all our branding for it's, <laughs> it's nice being in LA One and kind of like helping out without kind of, you know, um, I mean, like, you know, kind of like being on the crew for like sort of thing mm -hmm. isn't really me, I think. But I like to kind of like contribute in a way by being in the station mm -hmm. and like speaking to everybody and chatting to them. And, you know, they helped me with all the tech issues that I had in terms mm -hmm. of designing the logo. And it's, it's a learning process, which is really nice. And um, just speaking to you guys was really nice. Yeah. And, you know, getting like cups of tea from the kitchen oh, was really no. nice. And I felt <laughs> very much at home. So, yeah, it was, it was really good. Mm -hmm. Even though I am from the other side. Um, yeah, a bit of a rivalry. Yeah, it is a bit of a rivalry. <laughs> um, mainly, you know, partly my fault. But, um, <laughs> but um, no, it's nice to come over to the enemy lines and kind of like, yeah. you know, feel just as own. So, yeah. I mean, I feel like all the student media should be a bit more collaborative yeah, anyway. Yeah, and I feel like... You, you know that's that's something that's shared a by a lot of people point. yeah exactly yeah and um i feel like a lot of people are, are open to doing that as well mm -hmm. yeah so like yeah. myself for instance yeah um, exactly but yeah yeah it's a i don't know it's a it's a nice kind of time to be in student media at the moment yeah definitely we should get scan on board yeah do something with scan <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're looking at, a, the, looking an, at an audience one of member our there. studio audience members there <laughs> There he is, Michael. Michael. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, speaking back to the time when I was on your show. Yes. Um, that was a fun time. Like, I felt so flattered that you'd even asked me. You were just <laughs> like, yeah, I've been looking at guests to come on my show. I was like, well, yes, well, I will be on your show. <laughs> the point of the show is to kind of make you feel like a, like a celebrity and kind of like. I it's did feel like a celebrity. I really did. <laughs> <laughs> and the thing is, it's, like, it, it's nice to see people be so happy about talking about themselves and their favourite music. Mm -hmm. And um, that's the point of the show. It's all about making people open up about, mm -hmm. you know, give them a chance to shine for two hours as mm -hmm. long as they want, talk about their favourite things and you know, life in general and just kind of, yeah, feel like a celebrity, mm -hmm. like a. Because not many people get a chance to be interviewed like that. Yeah, um, exactly. Like you know, um, I mean, this is your moment now. Yes, it is. <laughs> yes, you know. So it's it's uh, it's nice for you to return the favor. But um, <laughs> but yeah, no, it's 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 nice to kind of like see people get so excited about being a celebrity, basically. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I feel like we really got to know each other as well. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we we actually get like really kind of like um, it actually gets really kind of like deep sometimes on the show actually. So yeah, it's really um, it's really nice. I think that I like it because it's not just enjoyable for the audience mm -hmm. and the friends of the guest it's really enjoyable for the you know the guests of the show because they can listen back to it in a couple of years time or something and kind of like you know see what it used to be like mm -hmm. and you know what's changed since then but also kind of just i don't know reflect on everything definitely i mean I've, I've shown the podcast to my parents and yeah exactly they yeah. Love it. yeah it's a big <laughs> hit of kind of like people's families and you know parents stuff like that and you know it's it's a really nice way for people to open up about themselves definitely yeah. um and Speaking of being a celebrity, you're a celebrity on the next Strictly that's coming up next year. I want to say celebrity. Well, I, I am you are. You're the, you know, well, well, that's what they call them. The, <laughs> okay. the celebrity contestant. The, yeah, yes, I know, am. Yeah, As I opposed am to the professional ballroom dancer. How's uh, all that going? <laughs> well, it's going well, actually. Um, yeah, we need to record our next uh, Cha Cha Chat, yeah. um, where you actually get to see me practicing with my partner, yeah. Ella Wong. But, um, but yeah, it's going well. It's nice to kind of... Um, yeah, like learn how to dance. The reason why I like to do it, wanted to do it in the first place is because I thought everybody needs to learn to dance someday, and I cannot. So, <laughs> but like, I don't know if I still can. Even with each practice, but You'll learn a lot from this. Yeah, I, I think I learned a lot as, from as, it. Yeah, as, well. as a past, as as a past a, celebrity. Yeah, previous celebrity contestant. <laughs> <laughs> I've asked you for tips as well, haven't I? So yeah, yeah. I, I don't think I was much help, but <laughs> well, you know, there you go. Yeah, it's, it's uh, 
I'll get I'll get those into you. Yeah. yeah. And finally, is there anything you want to plug? You said you've got a Christmas show. Yes. Coming out. So um, Siri is going to be on my Christmas special of Desert Island downloads, um, which is coming out. It might come out on Christmas Day. So. Um, oh, that's yeah. exciting. It's it's an interesting premise. So it's um it's I'm re I'm reinviting eight ghosts of Christmas past, present, and future, aka guests of the show. Actually, I might change it to eight guests of past, present, and future. That's I like it. This idea gets better like and better. It. It's a gift yeah. that gets improving. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm going to be inviting guests from the past of the show, people who have been on it very recently, and also people who have yet to be on it, um, to talk about their one favorite Christmas song. And it'll be a kind of a big compilation of like mini segments. Mm -hmm. But um, it'll be nice to kind of you know have you know Christmas stories, you know people talking about their favorite things about Christmas, and uh, the nice selection, the nice broad range of Christmas songs. So oh, yeah. That sounds great. I'll be definitely, well, I'll be in yeah, it, you'll but be like, on, I'll, you'll be I'll it, definitely so. be listening to it anyway. Um, but yeah, thanks, Sam. Um, it's, it's now time for my Christmas joke. Oh, no. Um, <laughs> so I've been planning hard about what I'm going to come up with for my jokes, and um, this is a popular one. Uh, what do you call a reindeer with no eyes? I don't know. No idea. <laughs> no idea. Guys, no idea. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Speaking of reindeer, let's have a look at um, a little chat we had with some Christmas reindeer. Hi, how are you doing guys? We're here with LA1 TV. Are you up for a quick chat? Yes, yes, that's absolutely fine. So how's your Christmas going? Um, well, if I'm honest with you, it's not going too great. They just put us in this hay and expect us to stand here in front of all these people and just do nothing. Isn't that right, Tony? Yeah, I mean, it isn't great. I mean, well, it's not great at all. We've just brought this up with Santa in the past. The repression of the non-red-nosed reindeer. Yeah, we took it to the union. Do you mind, Tony? I'm just trying to speak to this nice young man here. Sorry, Doris. So, as I was saying, we took it to the union and had to talk all about this hay we're being forced to eat. I mean, our Tony has gained three stones since he started on this job. Ain't that right? Right, Tone? Yeah, it is. I got myself a proper hay belly now. <clears throat> yes, you do. Sorry, Doris. Yeah, on with the show. Let's get Rueda down here. Woo! Woo! Come along, gal. Come along. How's it going? Going good. Yeah, it's going good. I'm all right I'll as well. It, I think it's going well, to be fair. Like, yeah. you know, I mean, there was that one technical difficulty we had, but it could have been worse. At least we got that amazing joke. Exactly. It, so. I yeah, mean, no, 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 I, <laughs> I think it was all about the joke. Like, <laughs> you know, I mean, I, I am the star of the show. It's all downhill <laughs> from that joke, really. That oh, no, it, Sam, it only gets better. Oh, like that, 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 no, that means the exact opposite. <laughs> it's going to get worse, I know it. The last Don't joke, I, her. I've got one about a snowman, and that one's the best. Well, actually, it's about two snowmen. Mm. Or one snowman, one snowwoman, you know? Equality in that. Yeah. Let's do this. Yeah. <laughs> so, Rueda. Yes. I would consider you, like, my best friend oh. at uni. Like, as cheesy as that sounds, like, you are definitely my best friend. So I'm, kind of, I'm kind of offended, to be honest. Um, yeah. I mean... You're all right, Sam, but like... <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, we don't share the same sense of humor, so... Oh, it's all right, Sam. You can just uh, you can just sit there and be quiet, you know. I've got Rueda <laughs> now. I've got Rueda now. She's my next my guest. My hands shine. Yes. Okay, right, yeah, okay. exactly. Come okay. on, Sam. <laughs> right. um, but yeah, we'll, we'll just talk about, like, how we, how we became friends, because I actually don't remember. You how don't remember, and you call me your best friend. I, I mean, like, how... We met in um, in a seminar. Yeah. Do you remember? Oh, you, you were like a pink top because that said vegan on it, <laughs> and I was like, <laughs> and then I was like, okay, she's not one of them, so it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> that just seems like classic me <laughs> when I was in first year and really like obsessed with the fact that I'd just become a vegan. I was like wearing all this like vegan branded stuff, like you know, really like yeah, I'm a vegan. Oh no. And now it's just like I just don't wear them out the house. Mm. <laughs> But I remember that you were, we were sat next to each other and we yeah, bonded. We did instantly. <laughs> Can we, we say what we bonded over? I don't. No, I don't remember what we bonded over. <laughs> we bonded over our exes. Oh uh, yeah. yeah. Actually, at the time we, it was a current boyfriend. It was a current boyfriend at the time. Him, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was a bad person. <laughs> he was bad. Oh goodness. Following <laughs> uh, the Christmas break, let's not talk about him <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> but it's okay. I mean, our, you know, it all sort of like 
that's sort of went that's from there. That's literally what we, I'd like go to your house for hours. Your yeah, flat, we, I remember the about. first like friend dates that we had and like we were just kind of like oh like what are you up to what are you up to <laughs> and then I was just like yeah I'm not really up to anything and then you're like can I come round to watch a film and I was like yes and of watched course the Exorcist. and then we watched The Exorcist <laughs> <laughs> and then of that was that I feel like that was my choice yeah it was <laughs> yeah, it <laughs> seems like, like for me because <laughs> <maybe, yeah. laughs> I don't know why but we just didn't think to go on Netflix or anything and I had like a couple of DVDs that I'd brought yeah. to uni with me <laughs> And The Exorcist just happened to be one of those yeah. DVDs. You know, talk well, about it. I don't know why. What else was in the selection? Um, there was Inception, because okay. that's my favourite film of all time. Oh, okay. You know, fun fact. Fun fact about the series. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, there was Casablanca, because that's my second favourite film of all time. Okay, nice. Um, and I think The Exorcist, I just brought that along because I'd never seen it before we watched it together. So I think maybe that's why we watched it, because I was just like, oh, I've never seen this. And yeah. then you were like, yes, we need to watch this. Was, it, was it a fun kind of friendship experience? I think yeah. It, yeah, it was. I mean, it was so really much fun, fun watching that, because I think we pretty much just <laughs> talked all the way through it. We did. <laughs> we really did. Yeah. We actually okay. didn't watch any of it. So. Yeah, was I can't it? remember what we talked about, but we were just like gossiping, Gossip. I think. Yeah. Is it fun for the whole family? Yeah. It was. Yeah. You know, yeah. the whole family we have, like, Go in here. <laughs> Siri recommends The Exorcist for your family. <laughs> Get it oh this God. Christmas. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna just write, like, scratch that comment. <laughs> but yeah, how's third year going? How's how's it going? It's all right. I mean, yeah. I mean, we're on the same course. Yeah, <laughs> it's not going great for me. No. <laughs> so yeah, like I wanted to say it's going fucking awful, but yeah. you know, I thought. I'd Do you know what? Like, we have to just be honest yeah. on the show. Like. It's not going great. It's not going great. It's not going great, but like we've got a positive attitude about it. Um, um, we try to. We try to have a positive attitude yeah. about I'm it. Not, I think I'm not getting that kind <laughs> of aura at the minute. I don't know. I, mean, I don't know what it is. I can just kind of tell. It was just. It just wasn't great. I mean, like we didn't realize we didn't have to do a dissertation, and then it was just like. Yeah. And then it. Similar thing. At the actually. dissertation <laughs> meeting, we were like, "Oh crap." Yeah. Well, now we're stuck with it. So. Yeah. Go on, what were you saying? Well, I didn't, well, I re didn't realise I, I don't do a dissertation. Yeah. So I'm doing like a research project. It's not part of your course? No, I mean, I like, do s something so similar, but not a dissertation. Mm. So. Mm. What yeah. are you doing your research on? Um, I can't tell you, actually. <gasps> Why yeah. not? It's top secret. It's like... Um, oh, wow, that's so cool. I, I genuinely cannot tell you. <laughs> like, I, literally, like, I, cannot, I can't tell you. I'm it's sorry. Right. It's not like we're live on air or anything. You can tell <laughs> us. Uh, right, okay. No, but I, 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 can't, I, can't, I can't. I'm sorry. Uh, we'll yeah. respect, respect mm -hmm. the wishes. Are you, you. are you going out on Friday? Segue into maybe. Christmas plans? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. It's uh, tomorrow. Oh my god, yeah. Tomorrow. 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 Oh my god. Are you go yeah, we're going out. Yeah, we are. Okay, yeah. I, I think it's like tomorrow night I'm just going to like, start drinking and not stop until like, you know, New Year's. And just yeah, constantly in a state of inebriation. Plan. That sounds like literally Alcoholism. ideal. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 well, every few like you know hours or something, just take. You know, we'll just check drink. in on you every now and again. Yeah, like, yeah. Hey Sam, are you still alive? <laughs> 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 but yeah, we're going out, and yeah. we've we've got a little plan. Okay. Yeah. So like since day one, we've been saying we want to dress up as Nicki Minaj and Ariana Grande. So going to happen tomorrow. Yeah, that Ace is going to be Nicki Minaj and I'm going to be Ariana Grande. It's very Christmassy. Yeah, I mean, it's like, <laughs> it's, it's, I mean, okay, it's not Christmassy. Yeah. But like it's worse under her and then it'll be fine. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Just yeah. an Ariana Grande Christmas. She has a Christmas album. She has a Christmas so album. A, exactly. It's a Christmas costume. Yeah. That's as good link as ever, yeah. ever really, so. But what are you wearing? Because I was going to ask you this before, but I thought we can talk about this on air. I'm wearing... Um, no, I'm not. I've not fully decided yet. Oh, okay. I'll uh, post some pictures. Yeah, so that's that's see. good idea. <laughs> I think I know what I'm wearing. I'm gonna wear my classic knee-high boots, yeah, which I've worn to. on this show before. So. And you, you have know. to do the ponytail. The ponytail or the half pony. The half yeah, pony is a classic. Yeah. Um, I've also got some little, you know, ears that she often wears. I could, I oh, could go the for the ears. Yeah, like the little cat ears. So that could be, that could be a winner. Who do you want to go out? Yeah. <laughs> if you could dress up as a pop star tomorrow, who would it be? Yeah. <laughs> I, I think you'd I'm the worst person for that. Britney. 
what you think? Yes. Yeah. I think I think Britney. <laughs> yeah, sure, whatever, I don't care. Yeah. Oh. Well, <laughs> I'm sure you'll think of something great and you'll have a great night anyway. <laughs> but anyway, it's time for my next Christmas joke. Are we oh all ready? No. I'm Are ready we all ready, guys? Now. Brace yourselves. Okay. What do you call an elf carrying some books? A bookshelf. Shelf. A shelf! A oh. shelf! <laughs> right, to be fair, I think that was my best, and if that didn't get a good reaction. Um, Did you do make these up? Oh, well, I made the elf one up, and I've made the <laughs> snowman joke up, but I didn't make the reindeer joke <laughs> Okay, yeah, because I think I've heard no Yeah. <laughs> I should have a team of writers, I think. Yeah. I mean, I thought I was good enough, Sam. What are you saying? Mm. What? What? I don't... What does the audience think? Do you think she should have a team of writers, or just... It's questionable. Lots of nods. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, next term, I shall hire a team of writers. Then. <laughs> but anyway, let's invite our next guest on, Chris Osborne. <laughs> Hello. Hey, Chris. I had a whole introduction planned for you, but I thought, you know what? Not bother. We we don't need to bother with that. Like, it's it's Chris. Let's just get him on the show. Let's just crack on. Yeah. Thank you. Hey, Chris, how you doing? <laughs> Not bad, you? <laughs> I'm, I'm all right as well. So, um, yeah, in the script, I've got... <laughs> Are we so going back to the script now? <laughs> no, we're going back to the script, Chris. Oh, that's a novelty. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I've put in the script, how did we become acquaintances? I, can't, I just genuinely can't remember. Just just Apparently, I'm not I'm a friend. Yes, we've got friend, okay. <laughs> but we've got friend. best friend, friend, <laughs> acquaintance. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know why I'm going to annoy you. Um, I genuinely can't remember when I met you. Um, it would be when you first turned up to LA on TV, I'm yeah. assuming. I remembered when I met you. Okay, this was... Do I want to hear this? Um, <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm going to, whether <laughs> I like it or not, aren't I? You're going to hear it, okay. So... Um, I went to the first members meeting by myself, um, so I felt really overwhelmed, didn't really know what was going on, um, and then they were talking about Good Morning Lancaster, and I thought, you know what, I'll get involved, let's see what happens. So then um, go to my first episode of Good Morning Lancaster, and there you were, and that's, that's where we first met, and I just thought, oh, that's an interesting character. <laughs> I'm not. Because that that interesting that. is one of those words that can have several meanings, isn't <laughs> it? <laughs> and I'm not entirely sure it it's a good one. I think I, I just thought it was funny because um, you brought like a spare set of clothes. For oh, was I presenting? presenting? You were presenting, <laughs> okay, and yeah. you brought like a change of shirt, and I thought yeah. that was like. Oh, is, is that what we do? Do we have to like change into a costume if we're presenting? <laughs> <laughs> and I was just so like, you know, perplexed with the whole idea. It was just, it was crazy. And then, um, and then I properly like sort of got to know you a bit more like in the following weeks when. And you just realised I couldn't dress myself well enough <laughs> yeah. to that, actually that was go the on main camera. Thing. <laughs> but it was when we were presenting together that I thought, oh right, it's Chris. You know, I once did actually have a sh I t well, roses uh, two years ago. I took a load of shirts up because I knew I'd be presenting quite a few shows over the weekend. And I went to put one of the shirts on mm -hmm. and literally my two co-presenters grabbed it off me and chucked it in the bin. <laughs> yes, you've told me this story. Wasn't very happy. No, but like I wouldn't put it past them to do that. I mean, yeah. I've seen the way you dress, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Siri. <laughs> Maybe Sam, I should have joined you in radio. Yeah, you should. Yeah. 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 <laughs> have you got a spare change of clothes for you know to replace that? Yeah. Well, I've you're wearing. Well, thanks. Do you <laughs> not like my roadkill reindeer? Uh, I mean, Christmas I was saying, I was saying it all just kind of blends into one, doesn't it? <laughs> thanks. No, I must admit, my parents bought me this jumper, and when I, when um, <laughs> oh, I package arrived, <laughs> <laughs> I did open it and think, what oh. on earth is this? I quite like it now. Like it, it is nice. It's nice. But yeah. he does sort of look like he's been hit by a car, oh, bless which is a bit sad. No, that, that would be that would be yeah, a bit yeah, sad. That would be the effect, wouldn't it? Yeah. 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 Bit sad, but yeah. yeah. But yeah, I do I do need to just like say that me and Chris don't actually hate each other. We just I didn't we just really um, hate well each we, other. Well, we well we do, but like. It's just funny. We just bully each other. It's yeah, just we banter. Do. You know? I love bullying. It's yeah, Hilarious. exactly. It's oh my god. <laughs> it's, it's what? <laughs> Such a nice, friendly bunch of people yeah, yeah, yeah. on like TV, isn't it? Friendly bullying. I mean, like, I don't bully Chris. It's just character building. He wouldn't be half the man he is today if it wasn't for me. <laughs> Thanks, Sue. I think I managed seven years here without you, didn't I? Yeah, but it wasn't until I arrived on the scene that you really thought, 
Yes, Ellie wanted to play Smee. He was an interesting <laughs> character when you first saw him. Now he's an even more interesting character. Exactly, yeah. Sam. Exactly. I mean, like, I would describe you as our LA1 TV veteran. Like, whenever you come back, it's like, oh, Granddad's home. <laughs> <laughs> you make it sound like I need a carer. <laughs> I'm a bit sad. You've, you've already had most of the discussions today <laughs> with Sam that I was hoping to join in on because, because like you, I've both been on Sam's show, mm. which I think was probably yeah. the longest episode you've ever had. Yes, yeah. Um, because I just wouldn't shut up. <laughs> yeah. um, and I which also the point. that's just like a yeah. running theme with you, Chris. <laughs> I mean, that's why I've told you we've got seven minutes. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> which sorry. Can come to that. <laughs> People no, shouting sorry, in sorry. your ear. Yeah. <laughs> no, um, and also, I, of course, I'm hosting the charity showcase this year with oh, Strictly. Yes, yeah. Yeah. So I'm going to be very interested to see how <laughs> <laughs> you've, you've done it. And you competed with Gary. You come second. I did it. come second. All the best people come second. Yeah, but there was a lot of pressure on me to come second because like everyone who'd done it from LA1 had always come second. So yes. they, were, they were telling me like, if I don't come second, that's it. Like, I'll to be honest, <laughs> with <laughs> the greatest respect to Ben K, I have no idea how he came second because yeah. Um, well, I think there might have been some blind people in the audience <laughs> voting for him. I don't know him. how I came second, to be fair. I mean, my dance wasn't great. It was good, though. I mean, it was. we had a good story. I think yeah. it was a good story. Mm. But, I mean, like, I thought there were people better than me. <laughs> True. It's all, it's all about the story. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we had a good story, to be fair. But, yeah, Beanock, Chris Osborne, what, what did you get up to during your time, other than, like, what? Strictly and... You know, and that. What did you get? He to? has a list, by the way. I d yeah. Yes, I was saying. <laughs> I told Siri earlier. I did actually make decide <laughs> when I left you to say, "Oh, I'll just jot down a few things I've done, so I can remember them." And yeah, it ended up like four pages. <laughs> just like whips out like a scroll. No, yeah. <laughs> honestly, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. yeah, no, because um, I, I was here for eight years doing a PhD that I haven't quite finished yet. Um, <laughs> Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny Parks is laughing oh, at me over there. No, I spent, um, <laughs> I, bec I, and I haven't finished yet, because I spent, A, now I have a full-time job whilst I'm trying to do it, but mm -hmm. B, because I spent too long doing TV and music stuff and mm -hmm. sort of AV events tech mm -hmm. and events organisation. Yeah. I mean, you poured a lot of your heart and soul into LA1. I mean... I did, yes. Yeah, I mean, you. I'm not going to lie, Chris, I'll give you some credit here. You did really like build this station thank you Siri. you did and I, i'm very grateful to that you know as station manager now it's like no just thought i'd put that out there <laughs> <laughs> yeah but yeah thanks chris no it's good to, it's, it's great to come back and see it mm -hmm. um doing so well as well it's great to yeah. come back i must admit I, I only literally intended to pop in pick some stuff yeah. up that but I as left soon as i saw time. you i was just like you know chris has to come back and be a guest he on can the come show. and talk he can come and talk <laughs> for a while you know why not we've got a slot for another guest let's go for it yeah. So, what are you up to now then? I'm. I'm. Well, two things. Main. Well, there's the PhD, which is currently being finished, mm -hmm. as always. As um, always. I work as a vision engineer for an outside broadcast company, so mm -hmm. I do a lot of football and rugby matches. I'm actually up because in, I'm doing a Man City game this weekend. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm also chair of the National Student Television Association, um, which is exciting. We <laughs> had a. We actually um, had a big meeting, general meeting. Uh, last night no yeah, two I nights ago I missed that I was the supposed, Siri was supposed to, be to be there but she missed I but, know um, no. but things I are going very well I decided to go that. home instead I was I was needing a good home fix um, and if you follow me on Snapchat you would have seen cute pictures of my dog yes yeah. it's all worth it yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so yeah that keeps up that keeps a lot of my time when I'm not working and doing a PhD yeah so that's exciting you keep very busy any plans yeah. for Christmas uh, I'm going home. I've actually managed to get Christmas off this year mm -hmm. because, um, oh, nice. sadly, football and rugby and things like that don't stop for Christmas. No, yeah. Uh, I don't always I get a break, say. but I am going home on the 19th and I'm mm -hmm. going home for about 10 days. Oh, that's really good. Which is quite good. nice. And then yeah. coming back to work for New Year. Yeah. Oh, that's good. So what, what are your plans for Christmas? Me? Um, I'll be home for two weeks and I'm going to Bangor for two weeks to do my dissertation research. Ooh, that's ooh, exciting. Nice. Yeah, and that's it's hard to go. It'll be warmer, which will be good. Definitely. Nice family. Yeah, yeah, that's cool, that's cool. Um, mm. Work on an essay, stay inebriated, and... Um, <laughs> Is this yeah. work on the essay while Yeah, of inebriated? course, yeah, you know, I mean, I've just kind of, kind of, you know... Just I'm sure it. it'll be your best work. Yeah, yeah, very well spelt and... Uh, <laughs> um, but um, apart from that, just, you know, chill out, basically, read a lot, yeah. Mm. Sounds good, guys, and I hope you all have a good Christmas. What about you? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh are we going to do me? Okay. Um, <laughs> well, I think I'm just going to go home, spend time with my dog Spencer. You're going to dress him up family. for Christmas? Of course. I always dress him up. Does he like being dressed up, or does he look at you thinking, who is this mad girl 
who is putting me into these ridiculous costumes. He actually loves it and he looks adorable. But anyway, we've got a joke. We've got another oh joke. God, I know no. you guys are Come trying to ears, avoid folks. the joke just then. <laughs> but no, we've got another, another one. You made up. Another you one just, you I just made got up. Crackers, okay. No, no, this, these are ones I've made up. Okay, okay so it's about right. a snowman. Okay, let me, hang on, how does it go again? <laughs> 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 okay, there's two <laughs> snowmen, and then one has just found out some really good gossip, and then tells it to the other snowman, and then this snowman goes, whoa, did that really happen? And then this one goes, yeah, snow joke. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm not yeah. sure if he was laughing or uh, being attacked in the, uh, in the studio <laughs> audience there. <laughs> That was a laugh. I'm we, need, take we need that to strictly as a number paddles. Preferably yes, on the yes. zero, the yeah. one, and the two, I yeah. think would do. Go on, what would you rate that then? One out of ten. What? Come on. Well, it's not zero. Out of ten, four. You're being generous. You're definitely brilliant. <laughs> uh, two, one extra point for general, um, like, you know, like, you know. Word. Effort? Creativity and effort. There we yes. go. Oh, well, thanks, guys. <laughs> now, we're going to move on to some challenges. So. Uh. Our first challenge is going to be pin the beard on the Santa. So if we can invi invite Jane onto the show. Woo! Woo! Let's go, Jane! Mm. Jane's our runner. Mm. She's going to also be our Santa. So, right, these are our Santa clauses. And um, Santa is in need of a beard. So we've got some sellotape where the beard should go. And we've got some cotton wool, which will also make up the beard. We're going to blindfold you, and you're going to have one minute to get as many of these on the beard as possible. And whoever gets like the most cotton buds, cotton wool <laughs> balls <laughs> on the beard wins first place. Then whoever comes second comes second. Whoever comes third comes third. So who wants to go first? Go yes, she <laughs> will, Sam. Yes, she will. All she right, let's do this. All right, Sam. Do you want to just like That's tie empty. that around your face? <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. You can do this, Sam. I have faith in you. There you go. Is that too tight? The, That's the cotton wool. Cool. Can okay. you see out of it? Nope. Here you go. Here's your here's your little bag. Oh, okay. this is okay. Um, okay. Do you want to? Crouch, Jane. <laughs> go back a bit. I think we should have him a bit for. Or do we? Do you want to stand up? If yeah. both of you. Oh, right, okay. Up, there we go. Yeah, go on, right. Sam. Sam, there just come back a bit because <laughs> otherwise, I can see the way this <laughs> is going to go. If you do it first, this you're going to be two well meters closer. Oh, oh it's okay, Sam. It's okay. We've got you. This is We've terrible. You. There you go. Stand there okay. a bit. Wait, right. what? What's he going to do? Are we gonna throw them. Throw yeah. Him? Okay. I mean, on. I wasn't expecting the throwing, but fair enough. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Anne. All right, I'm going to give you a minute. Just Starting right ahead of you. from I three, two, I'm just going to be throwing them all over one. the set. That way. Straight ahead, Go. yes. Up a bit. Higher. Up a bit higher. Up a bit. Oh. Go. Oh, oh nearly. Oh. No, <laughs> left a bit. Throw it a bit higher. <laughs> this is oh, so no, more Sam. More. This is not going well. Oh. Bit, a little bit harder. <laughs> Throw it harder. Jane, help left. him out a bit here. <laughs> oh, he oh okay. Oh, left okay, a bit. Left. Okay. Oh, 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 that was. Yeah. Okay. This is okay. This isn't working. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> really? I say, you think? I say, move closer and just try and get as many on in ten seconds. So I'm, I'm going to shorten it down because it's going to be easier. No, but actually go close to it. I, yeah. I okay. don't know how close it's going. Okay. okay. Yeah. There you go. Okay. I'm going to give you ten seconds. Three, two, one, go! Uh. Is this happening? Is it, is it sticking Ooh, on the beard? Are some sticking on the beard? Yeah. I can't see. Yeah. Yes, okay. Yeah. Okay, stop! This is the worst thing I've ever done. Okay, <laughs> oh, that's all right. We've that's got a good, good beard there. Got a good beard. Okay, we'll put that down. Yes, well done, Sam. Put that back down on oh the Oh my table. goodness, what have I done? Next part <laughs> of the bit. <laughs> go on, right. Rueda, you can do this. Chris, what was that throwing idea? That was never going to work. Well, if you get, you gave him a minute. I'm sure well. he'd get a couple of them on. No, he was just trying to, you know, get an advantage. Yeah, Shh. definitely. Right. It's not okay. like so I'm that competitive. Stand, yeah. up. stand <laughs> up and then face. Here's the uh, that bag. way. Yeah, there yeah. We go. and then there's the bag. That's the bag. 
Right. Okay, I'm going to give you 10 Where's, seconds. Can I feel the paper? Where is the paper? Yeah, there you go. Right. <laughs> Just move it. <laughs> move it. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Uh, <laughs> Come on, you can do this. Like it's snowing. <laughs> <laughs> it's snowing. Three, two, one, stop. Oh, that's a good beard. I think that's a that's a decent beard there. Thank you. It's like quite like <laughs> evenly spread out, I think. <laughs> no? cool. Okay. But it's all about the numbers. And that seems to have like quite a lot in the front bit. You can do this, Chris. Come on. Mm. You were born ready for this. Thank you. I can see him getting ready. <laughs> yeah. Do you know what, Chris? Since what? you wanted to throw them, <laughs> and you thought it would be so easy. You're going to make you know, me throw them? I'm going to make you throw them. I'm okay. going to give you, I'll I'll done give you something 20 seconds. Wrong here. I'll give you 20 seconds. I won't give you Can someone who can actually oh, see really? what they're doing <laughs> tie this on my can head, you please? Help me because <laughs> you're only an acquaintance. You, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and yeah, because you're the acquaintance. You can have. Is, this you can have is that on your eyes? Right, that is now. Right. So it's one last challenge. One no. last Santa beard, <laughs> and you're good uh, to and go. And I'm throwing them, yeah? Yeah, yeah. okay, I'm going to give you 20 <laughs> seconds. Starting from three, two, one, go. <laughs> Left a bit. No, <laughs> go right. No, right a bit, right, right a bit. Go right. right. Same, same, like, okay. level. Down. <laughs> Try throwing good, down no, a Right a bit more. You need to go right, Chris. What are you oh, doing? Near the end, near the <laughs> Oh, a little bit you lower got than the Five. Four, three, two, one. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> yeah, no, that was that was a complete fail. <laughs> oh. a complete fail. Oh, yeah. I mean, it was just that. That's just it. That Santa's like well, I had beardless fun. now. <laughs> I mean, that's all that matters. We've got more. We've got more games to come. Oh goodness, no! Please. We need. <laughs> let's, let's just count how many. How many's on here? I do think there's a clear winner. Do you want to count you know? how many's on each of these? And then oh, let us know it. the winner, and then we'll move on to the next challenge. So we're going to play Snog, Marry, Avoid, nice. but with Christmas characters. Yeah. Okay. So it's go it's going to be interesting. So our our first, you know, group of three, we've got the Grinch, we've got Santa Claus, and Jack Frost. So, yeah. Okay, I, I know. Okay, I know, okay. Wait, no, it's, it's not Jack Frost. It's not Jack Frost. Um, marry Santa. Marry Santa. Of course, he's rich. He can afford all his presents. Exactly, like seven exactly. People. Um, and avoid the Grinch. Avoid the Grinch. That's that's a good one, and I like yeah. your reasoning for yeah. the, <laughs> the three as well. I would um, snog the Grinch because I feel like we have a lot in common. Um, oh, <laughs> and why is that? So? Um, <laughs> I don't know. We just seem quite, you know. Miserable and kind of like you know angry what? on Christmas. So. What you think you're miserable? Uh, I don't know. I can relate. So um, oh okay. Yeah. Uh, I also I'm secretly green. So yeah. Oh yeah. okay. Uh, makeup it's just done a makeup. wonderful job exactly. today. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, I would I would avoid Jack Frost because yeah. uh, I don't know much about him. Yeah. Oh, but yeah. would you not like to just maybe get to know him? No, no. He seems a bit kind of you know. Cold, so yeah. Um, and I would marry Chris, uh, Father Christmas because I'm gay. So. I thought you were going to say marry. You could. <laughs> <laughs> I would. I would. Don't, don't, <laughs> don't, don't, don't let me get this. That was not an option. I would marry Chris. <laughs> That's not what <laughs> I was expecting when I came. <laughs> <in the show. laughs> um, but I, yeah, I would marry Santa because he seems yeah quite wholesome and yeah, yeah. Wholesome, wholesome guy. Wholesome yeah. is a good word to describe Santa. I'm not sure I agree with you. I'm oh. going to agree with oh, with your okay. set. I'm going to avoid the Grinch. Okay. Um, reasons. But he's the Grinch. But no, do, why do, would, do you why need would you, more of a reason? Yeah, but like, why would you snog that particular character and marry that particular character for the same reasons as? Basically, I, I want to <laughs> avoid the Grinch, and I w I'd, out of the three, you'd marry Santa. Of course, because he's Santa. He's Santa. Um, but yeah, and okay. the whole flying sleigh thing's quite appealing. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. So which leaves? Uh, yeah, I forgot even who the third <laughs> person was. To be honest, Jack Frost. Jack Frost, yeah, has yeah, to be. Exactly. Um, there we go. Yeah, do you want my answers or should we just go on then? <laughs> okay, I would say I'd marry Jack Frost because I feel like it would just be a bit more exciting, wouldn't it? Like it would just be like, oh, something new. Whereas like Santa, 
Well, you dated a lot of fun I wasn't I mean, entirely <laughs> sure that's what marriage was yeah. about. But yeah. <laughs> I mean, like, I think Jack Frost, he keeps you on your toes, doesn't he? Like, you never know what's coming. Well, I and don't then, know like, him personally, so I can't know. say. <laughs> but, but I feel like Jack Frost would just be a bit more fun, whereas Santa, he's like, I mean, like, fair enough, like, the person you marry, you're going to settle down with them. But then, like, I don't know. Like, th these are all mythical beings, and, you know, they <laughs> live forever. How do you know? <laughs> I mean, I know the Siri's not getting any presents. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, do we have a winner for this one? Is the winner? This <gasps> one. <gasps> Ruwaida, you won. Oh, Congratulations. Thank well you so done. Much. The biggest Boo. one of my life. Okay. Boo. Okay. So we have some prizes as well, Jane. We've got some prizes. Okay. So, um, Chris, you don't get anything <laughs> because <Thank laughs> you, you lost miserably. Um, so which one would you like out of the antlers and the chocolate orange? Can yeah. I get the chocolate no. orange? <laughs> 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 oh, that's so nice. You know I love antlers. You are going to wear them now, Of course, yeah. Excellent. <laughs> Perfect. Amazing. It's like Rudolph's joined us in person. <laughs> Can okay. we just get this red pen and uh, put a red nose on it? Well, we're going uh, to be <laughs> using the pens in just a moment because our last challenge of the night is going to be drawing me in 30 seconds. Are, are you <laughs> this isn't going to go well. Yeah. yeah. You've got 30 seconds to draw me in a Christmas pose. A stick, a Christmas a stick people I acceptable, because that's about yeah, all yeah, my course. artistic yeah, ability Christmas allows. Yeah, fine. Um, but, yeah, just go for it. <laughs> Use your imagination. Go wild. You can do this. Pink pen. Yes. This one? Oh, Choose your pink pen colour wisely. I'm going to take a few more shots of the green one. And at the <laughs> end, oh God, he's got to be. <laughs> at the end, give it a cheeky signature and show it to the camera. How long have as we got? Well. You've got 30 oh seconds. Goodness. I'll count you down. Can we um, use different coloured pens? Yeah, yeah, of course. Switch it up a bit. But you do only have 30 seconds. That's okay. So, okay. Those seconds starting from now. Okay, guys. Come on. I'm really excited to see what Christmas poses. Gonna, I don't even know what a Christmas pose is, if I'm really honest. But like, yeah. And just think, there are going to be winners for this as well. So flatter me, you know. Like, make me look my best here, guys. <laughs> oh, I and am. you know, if you need any inspiration, just look this way. You know, get my best features in there as well. Okay, got five seconds. Three, two, one, stop. Give it a cheeky signature. Oh, no, this, this is terrible. Is so <laughs> this is not the concept oh, I, see a I was speech going bubble. for. <laughs> okay, okay. I How do I look? I want to do the exact same thing, except because it's slightly better. Go on. I want to see Who's what going it looks first? like. Go on, Chris. You so first. I have Siri decorating the tree, but I did accidentally draw the baubles in the same colour as the tree. Oh. Um, but yeah, okay. Siri decorating. Why is my hair so short, Chris? Because I didn't have time to draw it, draw it long. It would have taken oh, okay, another fair. like half a second to draw each one of those hairs, okay. which in 30 seconds adds up. That's, that's fair. To be, that's fair. I understand the thought. So Go on. I meant to draw you <laughs> chugging some old wine. <laughs> Ch chugging? I, I didn't really get the glass, <laughs> right? And you only got one <laughs> foot slash shoe. Oh, goodness. So oh, my God. You've been in a nasty accident <laughs> there, <Siri. laughs> It's nice. I like the hat, and y you've given me a really nice figure. To be fair, like you, you put a lot of fun. I really apart from the one leg. <laughs> apart from the one leg, you're like great down to your knees. Yeah. Isn't it? It's just not quite working, is it? Exactly. Um, Go on, Sam. But will you be chugging the mulled wine? I will be. Okay. I'll be chugging the mulled wine. Of course. Uh, I'll be. Mine's pretty terrible. Go um, on. So it's uh, <laughs> it's basically Siri. What does it say? Um, it's, it's, it, she's saying, "Here's a present." Here's a present. <laughs> to, to nobody in particular, which is representative of it's how, to it go will, my how it will be on Christmas Day. Yeah. Oh, we could put this oh. into like a chronological order, you know. Wait, wait, so she gets drunk, she yeah. decorates the tree and then and puts then a present under the tree. And there you you're, go. You're, you're giving the present to yourself. Yeah. You're treating yourself. So I've that sounds like yeah. Siri. Yeah, that sounds to like be, something you would do. To be fair, yeah. I don't even know which one I like the best. I actually really like them all equally. Um, hmm. I'm gonna vote for the present. Yeah. I'm gonna vote for the present. I just think that's a very cute that little cute. gesture. Yeah, thank you. And I feel like I'd be I'd be giving a good present as well. I'm good at present giving. To yourself. To myself. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, whenever I go Christmas shopping, I always just think I'd really like that. <laughs> <laughs> and then just end up buying loads of things for myself. Those are the best gifts. Yeah, those yeah. are the best gifts, you know? Treat yourself. Treat yourself. Yeah.
Exactly. Yeah, that's that's all we've got time for today, guys. But just before we leave, we're gonna get a special performance from Jonathan Parks. We're gonna he's gonna play us out doing a Christmas song. Don't know if he's ready or anything. Yeah, he's ready. We're good to go. Hey. Right, come on, guys, let's go. Beginners. Yeah, we're gonna go watch him. Okay, so the condition is if you've got a free hand, that means you have to grab a lyric sheet at the back. Oh, we've got lyrics. You've got to sing. Yes. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So, oh. one everyone knows, so you should got be got lyric sheets. That's the condition. Dance, sing along if you want to get it. While you're hanging up. Who has a ball? Does he ride a red nosed reindeer? Does he turn up on his sleigh? Or do the fairies keep him sober for the day? So here it is, Christmas, everybody. While you're waiting for the family to arrive Why you sure you got the room to spare inside or Does your granny always tell you That the old ones are the best Well then she's up and rock and rolling with the rest So here it is, Merry Christmas Everybody's having fun Look to the future now It's only just begun What will your daddy do When he sees your mama kissing Santa Claus? Ah, why are you hanging up your stocking on the wall? Why are you waiting for the snow to start to fall? Do you ride on down the hillside in a buggy that you've made? And when you land upon your head, then you've been slain. Everyone, so here it is. Merry Christmas, everybody's having fun. Look to the future now, it's only just begun. So here it is, Merry Christmas, everybody's having fun. Look to the future now, it's only just begun. Again, so here it is. Everybody's having fun Look to the future now It's only just begun One more time Here it is Merry Christmas Everybody's having fun Look to the future now It's only just begun Ha <laughs> ha